Alrighty, you guys, welcome back to a brand new episode here on The Ankle. Hey, Ember. <laughs> The ankle's a little mean. So this is like part 31 of our just overall social media deep dive, I guess. Started off as the Ask FMs and now we're on to old Facebook posts. So we'll just kind of move through and see what we can find, I guess. But thank you so, so much for tuning on in, you guys. I truly do appreciate y'all. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Like and subscribe. Become a channel member. And yeah. That's pretty much it. So let's just dive right on in, shall we? Sometimes arguing just makes you realize how much you love someone. Side eye. I don't know as though I've ever experienced that. <laughs> Usually takes me a day or two after the argument to come back around. <laughs> Got my grade and this long thing my teacher wrote about how I did. How can he say I did so well, but then my grade not be that good? Ugh. Two likes, but 173 comments is freaking crazy, yo. Freaking crazy. I, I need, I need to know. God damn. But like, girl, it's because he probably didn't have too high of expectations for you. <laughs> Something tells me that's it. My teacher rides the bus. That makes me laugh. LOL. And so does your broke ass. So, all right, they probably ride the bus a few blocks because they live close by the school or something. You have to wake up five hours early. <laughs> <laughs> Which, like, I don't know. It's just, like, complexity of her shitting on people for riding the bus when, A, she rides the bus. And, two, why would you even shit on that? Public transportation is there for a freaking reason. W ugh. What? Like, what? And four trashy people liked this? Gross. Gross. I want to see Crystal dribble a basketball. LOL. I'm not gonna lie, that probably would be pretty funny looking with the bangs and all that. But, yeah, you never know. <laughs> but, girl, all of the, like, flirting and whatnot with Crystal, it's a lot. And she's still with Casey. But also, like, that just seems kind of shady to post to Facebook, not gonna lie. I think I need to dedicate tomorrow to just homework. No TV, no music, no texting, no Facebook, nothing. I am so behind. I need to pass this class. Interesting, though, how it was first framed as, oh, I'm such a good student. I just love school. And how quickly that's going away, right? Also, just pay attention to the date. And then the very next day, the day she was supposed to go without, you know, anything. Effin asshole. <laughs> Bruh, eye roll. And you know that's about the... Is it stepdad or just Casey's mom's boyfriend? I'm just going to refer to him as stepdad. But I don't know what the connection is, to be honest. But yeah, she hated the stepdad. I think it's because he really didn't put up with her BS. I hate knowing someone like him. I can't stand him. He is the rudest and most controlling person I've ever met in my life. Amber, uh, have you met yourself? All right. Amber sees controlling as someone not letting her do whatever she wants to do. And that doesn't register in her brain as she's also being controlling. It's a 50-50 thing. Like, <laughs> I'm sure if you were more accommodating for them, they would probably be a bit more accommodating for you. But you don't accommodate people emotionally is more what I'm speaking of because she obviously can't physically accommodate anyone. You just drain people. Relaxing. Should be doing homework. Ugh. And one of y'all asked what this is. It's like just the, you know, dot, dot, dash, like, mm face. It's just a different way of doing it. And if you noticed Crystal comments using that, so... She got that from Crystal. That's what it means. <laughs> but of course, girly flop still ain't doing her homework. Good job, Amber. I want to use a strap on. Hee <laughs> hee. Who the hell posts that to Facebook? Who the hell posts that to Facebook? But then when you were with Crystal, wasn't it? We would never, ever use a toy. That is 
like cheating. I'm more than enough woman for my girl. Ew. <laughs> Finally, working on some homework while watching Say Yes to the Dress, LOL, and found out one of my friends kind of likes me. That's definitely Crystal. Definitely Crystal, and yeah, only kind of. <laughs> I'm never going to cook for an whole ever again. Well, it doesn't say ever. Okay, Jordan, calm down. I'm never going to cook for an asshole again. One comment. <laughs> Eye roll, dude, but you cook for yourself every day, Amber, so what are you talking about? <laughs> More just bitching, though, dude, like, and what do you mean, like, <laughs> you should be cooking all their meals. They're keeping you off the street, girl. Honestly, I'd eat a million eels for you. Definitely about Crystal, gross, but also, what the hell does that mean? What? <laughs> you know, maybe if I didn't live with Assholes, I wouldn't have to wake up at 5 a.m. to catch the bus to be at school at 9. Maybe if I didn't live with assholes, I'd get a ride. Oh my god, dude. If I saw this, this would have been the thing that gets her kicked the F out. What the hell is she freaking doing? Like, I'm sure they probably had stuff to do that made them not want to drive Amberlynn all over the place. They probably weren't even home at the time, dude. She just, ugh, it's all about me, 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 ugh, she makes my blood boil, she really, really does, and Amber, waking up at 5 a.m. to catch the bus, that's pretty average, all right, not everyone just has all the luxuries in the world afforded to them. I hate how people who aren't even fat complain about their weight when I would do anything to be their size, it makes me mad. But most of all, makes me sad. Eye roll. I'm a be honest. Now, don't get mad at me, y'all. That's a you problem, okay? If someone else's insecurity makes you feel even more insecure, I can understand, like, the nuance of it. But, like, that is on you, okay? Don't blame someone else for their own insecurity. That sounds, like, kind of really effed up, doesn't it? That's just my opinion. Like, I don't know. Just because someone is smaller than you doesn't mean that, you know, they can't be insecure about their own body. Like, hello. The grass is always greener on the other side, right? So, mm <laughs> Something I hate doing is opening a loud bag of hot Cheetos in a quiet classroom, lol. But you still do it, don't you, big? Yeah, go frickin' figure. And, of course, she's the girl that one is eating in the middle of a lecture. But also, <laughs> she thinks just opening the bag is loud and not her munching and crunching and smacking and licking her frickin' fingers the entire class. Okay, okay, there's that wonderful self-awareness you got, Amber. <laughs> the girl you just called fat? Okay, this is also just like one of those stupid chain post kind of things that was going around. It's so dumb, but I also find it ironic that Amber Lynn is like literally all of the things that she's talking about. It's not funny, but it kind of is. The girl you just called fat, she's been starving herself and has lost over 30 pounds. Well, that part's not Amber. <laughs> the boy you just called stupid, he has a learning disability and studies over four hours a night. That's definitely not Amber also, but, well, the first part is. The girl you just called ugly? She spends hours putting makeup on, hoping people will like her. Side eye. The boy you just tripped? He is abused at home. There's a lot more to people than you think. Put this as your status if you're against bullying. Yeah, but not everyone is in a tragic situation, all right? Let's chill. <laughs> Let's chill. I understand what she's trying to get at. But not everyone is just in a horribly tragic, traumatic situation, okay? Plus, I love how it just got only two likes. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that was so hurtful. Now the tears won't stop. Eye roll, what could this be about? Oh, someone said no to the McDonald's drive through Amber, there's food at home. <laughs> Facebook is pissing me off. <laughs> Okay, girl, whatever. Some people are so damn rude. Yeah, you'd know. <laughs> I hate trying to be nice, and then I just get told that they hate me, and that I am a bitch. 
It's just a lovely feeling. Ugh, I feel like crying again. So do it, dude. Oh my god. Freaking little crybaby about everything. And the thing is... Amber Lynn's trying to be nice. And that's that's the thing, isn't it? She was trying. She was trying to be nice. She wasn't just being nice. Amber Lynn is never just naturally nice. It's always trying because it's always for a means to manipulate. But I mean, you are <laughs> a bitch. I'm so sorry. They got you clocked. Have to go. Be back later. Really wanting this new phone. Grr. Well, maybe if Amby got herself a job, maybe if Amber got herself a job, she could afford a phone. That's my new song. <laughs> Girl, eye roll. But no, she's talking. Was it just an iPod that Crystal got her? So who bought the phone then? Because I know one of her past foster parents was paying for the phone bill for a while. Is the phone from them also? I don't know this part of the lore where she got her first phone from <laughs> well it's not her first phone but it's a new phone i effing hate crying it hurts so much it's so embarrassing to sit at my school and cry like this i roll dude oh my freaking god can you just imagine seeing her off in the corner bawling her freaking eyes out blubbering like I would feel bad, but if it were to happen, like, multiple, multiple times, something would ding off in my head that, like, something ain't right with this girl. <laughs> I mean that in the most respectful way, but I would definitely take notice and be like, oh, something's not right. Plus, like, shit. I was probably in the darkest period of my life during college. Never once did I have a public breakdown like that. Ooh, never once. There was, like, crying, you know? It's art school, y'all. You have to get deep in some of those classes, all right? And sometimes it's not easy. <laughs> and art becomes, like, really, really personal sometimes. But, like, that's different, you know? Not having a full-on breakdown because of whatever BS you're experiencing. And it's just the consequences of her own actions, truly. OMFG, I hate Facebook right now. The one time I want to effing talk to someone in an I am and it won't work. I get all this desperate people all damn. What? I emming me, but I effing can't talk to the person I want to. Of course not. Just my luck. I roll. How is she, even when Facebook is glitching, how is she the perpetual victim in it all? Girl, oh my Jesus. Oh my Jesus. How, no wonder your family kicked you out. No freaking wonder. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But once you turned 18, I'm sure they were glad as F to get you the hell out of there. I mean, it wasn't as soon as she turned 18. But she lived with them. See, I don't even know the timeline because it makes no freaking sense. She tells it 50 different ways. I roll. <laughs> I am hungry. Haven't eaten all day. I wish it showed the times. It would probably be like 6 a.m. <laughs> Bruh, who cares, Amber? You'll be fine. Watching TV. Bored. No school tomorrow. Thank God. Oh, well, I guess you could maybe take the bus and go apply to a few places to work at. Yeah, doesn't seem like you're all that busy with school, to be honest. Stupid maintenance man waking me up, throwing couches and chairs down the stairs. What the F? I was trying to sleep in. I roll. <laughs> Damn, so even on Pookie's day off, she couldn't even get a moment of peace. It's just always hell. <laughs> I kind of love how perpetually miserable she has always been. Oh, and by the way, thank y'all to everyone that purchased some merch. The sizing for the side eyes, side eyed, like hoodies, shirts, all that. I, oh my God, there's so many different little sections under the Shopify, Shopify thing. The sizes weren't listed originally. They are now. So there's that. <laughs> <laughs> and I think there's only, as of me recording this, there's only one of the mini toe in white and one in black left, I believe. So, just a heads up, y'all. But yeah, sliding back into this. I hate being with a selfish girl. It's starting to really old. I'm gonna be done soon. Oh, you promise? Do you promise? I'm sure Casey, who by this point 
told Amber about his identity. So she's purposefully choosing to misgender and ignore that. But, like, don't you think Casey's freaking tired, dude? Like, my God. I, I just, I mean, I don't love it because it's led her down the cycle that has abused so many people. But I kind of love how she is literally never the problem. Never. I hate. <laughs> Sorry, Bubba. That just scared the shit out of goo. I hate this damn class well drop out then bitch i'm sure they wouldn't miss you <laughs> i'm sorry i'm sorry but like girl i roll there were some classes i really freaking hated but you just go and get it done with if you live in america and want to talk inbox me i am so bored why i mean i know why she has to specify in america because she accepts all of the spam friend requests from fake like accounts from other countries because <laughs> remember that one person that commented sorry i am in namibia <laughs> girly is just accepting any bot and scammer that will send her a friend request any fake profile oh my god dude how desperate do you have to be <laughs> if you speak english inbox me eye roll that sounds bad I can't understand anything other than that, lol. Who would look at that photo of that and with a name like Amber Lynn Reed and think, oh yeah, that girl speaks multiple languages. <laughs> <laughs> OMG, I cannot believe this, LMAO. My guy friend likes me way too much. He knows I am a lesbian. What in the world is he doing? Iro, what are you doing posting that, Amber? What? What the hell are you talking about? And what man, men aren't in their right minds most of the time. So like, I get that. <laughs> but who, who, Amber, who? I'm gonna need names. Dude, let me tell you what. The list of people that actually like have crushes and like Amber Lynn, that is such a secretive and almost coveted list it feels like the epstein list you know what i mean like if that were to leak oof oof <laughs> the long list of names of people that actually like had crushes on amber lynn oh that'd be some tea <laughs> i guarantee you probably none of her girlfriends would have been on there except for tommy i am blocked from facebook for 14 days sorry everyone yeah i'm you're really letting a lot of folks down amber <laughs> you really are but how do you think she got blocked probably for some shit she posted getting my new phone wednesday i hope I roll. I roll. Yeah, keep hoping, girl. How was she getting all of these new electronics and stuff? Like, what the hell, dude? Anyone want to text? Two people, I guess. So there's that. Good job, Amber. We're rounding down to the last few, y'all. Got my new phone. Loving it so much. Where did she get a phone from? Where? Because I could have sworn the story is, is that Crystal got her an iPod. Not a phone, but an iPod. I don't know. Maybe it was an iPhone. I don't freaking know. Told y'all, I probably wasn't going to start packing today, lol. Makes me laugh. I am such a procrastinator. Okay. Okay. See, no one even interacted with that girl. Was that really post-worthy? Like, really? Okay. <laughs> oh, man. I have heartburn and it sucks. I would be drinking milk to ease the pain, but I live with an asshole. So let's scratch that and think of another way to fix it. Eye roll, dude. What the actual hell? What the hell? They probably ran out of milk and it was probably like 10 o'clock at night. Who's going to want to go out for milk at that time? <laughs> or something like and why is it on them why are they assholes because you can't afford your own shit that's so effed up in my opinion dude like they don't owe it to you someone who abuses them to make sure that you have everything that you need especially at the ripe old age of like 18 or 19 however old you were at this point like come on dude it's just so ungrateful and just so abusive and nasty sometimes i wonder if me and my girlfriend have a future i love someone else besides her and she likes someone else besides me why would you post that why the hell 
would you post that? And also, like, yeah, then clearly you don't have a future. So maybe you should, <laughs> I don't know, break up? Jesus, stop putting that family through so much shit, dude. Ugh. Ugh. It just, it irks me to my bone that every situation she has been in, she fully takes advantage of people, manipulates them, and doesn't provide anything nothing absolutely nothing she's emotionally and physically abusive like uh, uh, oh my god dude and it just keeps happening oh tommy you're in for a ride girl <laughs> anyways y'all thank you so so much for tuning on in i truly do appreciate you guys i hope you have a wonderful rest of your day you know, morning, noon, or night, whatever time it is. Uh, I'm going to get more, like, movie stuff recorded today. So that'll be out probably a little today, some tomorrow, maybe later in the week. But more stuff's coming there. And, yeah, I just appreciate you guys. Thank you so, so much. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Like and subscribe. Become a channel member. And I will catch you in the next one. Take care.